Well, you know, you know, our guys came in. I thought they played hard. I mean, it, uh, the scoreboard is not indicative of how hard our guys played. Uh, you know, Auburn is number seven in the country. We came in. We wanted to use the platform to to promote our program, to find ways that we can build our team. And I thought we'd done. You know, we did that, and and we're just moving forward. You know, our goals for the season is to win the swag, and obviously tonight. Nothing that happened uh, interrupted that. I mean, we'll get back and get ready for the next game and keep our goals in front of us and use this as a, as a building block. Coach, defensively, your guys played really aggressive. Got a couple turnovers, a couple strips. That's got to feel good against us. Oh, yeah, we'll, we'll take the good, you know, the good from it, and we'll, you know, show it to the guys, and we'll take some of the bads and, of course, alignment. You know, as you looked at it, you know, I mean, in a lot of the areas, we, we were outmanned, and, and it's to be expected. You know, we're playing a Power 5 team, and I just wanted to make sure our guys came in and played hard. And if there was a chance, then we would take advantage of the chance. But the key to it was use the platform to promote a program and to build our team and, and give our guys a chance to compete at the highest level of competition and uh, come out of it healthy. You, you got to see a lot of a lot of different guys in the game for you. Uh, what did you see from some of the guys that got in there in the second half? Well, you know, they, they have the NCAA has a new rule now that guys can play into four games in red shirt. So we knew we needed a lot of guys rotating in this, I mean, because they were running the power, wearing us down. And we wanted to, you know, put a, a variety of guys in so that we could, again, start identifying who's going to be those top guys as we move forward and get back into our conference play in a couple of weeks. Coach, it was one thing you are talking about, in, at least in the offseason, giving your fans a trip out of Jordan Air competing. You feel like your team competed for a time. Oh, yeah. It was so many times that it could have got, I mean, extremely ugly. But the guys kept fighting. They kept, you know, fighting for the football. They kept trying to move the football on one of the uh, number one defenses uh, that's in the country right now. And I, I just thought the guys fought well, and uh, you didn't see anyone dropping their head and just giving up. And uh, that, that's not what we're going to do. Coach, how do you uh, feel on what you guys, what they learned from tonight and moving forward? continue to re, uh, state the goals, what our goals are. Our goals is to win the swag. Nothing that happened here tonight uh, interrupts that. So we, you know, the key is getting out healthy, moving forward. Uh, you know, we had some guys that the uh, NFL that were looking at and wanted to see if they could play at day level. We had a bunch of scouts here tonight, and I think Titus Howard and uh, Elston Haley and those guys did a great job of, of, of uh, you know, promoting themselves that, there's no question Titus Howard can block anybody in the country, and, and uh, Elston Hill can pass rush against him as well.